Hello, this is Borna from Borna.tv, and today I want to talk about Dota Underlords, aka Auto Chess, aka Auto Chess Mobile, aka Team Fight Tactics. We're just going to lump into all of these different types of games. I want to put together a series of videos to teach you about this new genre that is popping up everywhere. So, in this first video, we're going to be talking about the basics. The very first thing you need to know that Auto Chess is not chess. There's nothing to do with chess, there's no chess anywhere. So, now you've got that out of the way, the game will be a lot easier to approach. And the goal of this video is to get you playing a game and get you the basics so that you can get started so the first thing i want to talk about is the board and the bench these are two areas that you're going to be manipulating quite often the board is where you'll place your units that you buy from the store these are the guys that are going to automatically fight for you auto chess games are automatic fighters you don't do anything yourself when it comes to fighting after you buy units they go to the bench this is where you keep units that you would possibly use later on now there's going to be a lot of a lot of combining and a lot of manipulation of these units so that you can get stronger and stronger I'm not going to focus on that too much you just need to know that when you buy a unit from the store that it will go to the bench now now that you know that the board is where you place your units to fight and the bench is where your units go after you buy them let's talk a little bit about unit synergy now when you buy units they have different types you don't need to know all the types by heart so don't get overwhelmed when you see all these different icons your goal as an auto chess player or dota underlords or whatever whatever you're playing is to combine the same types of units. For example, there's different races and there's also different classes. You wanna match the icons. That's all you need to care about. Once you decide that you're gonna match an icon, then you can determine what the synergies are. So for example, if you come up with three warlocks in the store, which is a certain type of icon, you can see what the synergy is and see if it meets your goal. Or you may wanna just try that and say, hey, that sounds cool, let's do that. That's pretty much it. That's auto chess basics. You combine synergies so that you can get a good build and a good layout on the board now there's a lot of other little things involved with all of this and a lot of meta and a lot of builds and things like that but for getting started your very first match you just need to match the different icons that's all while you're playing the match you can click on the button on the right to see your synergy so you can see how many of a particular icon you have. And if it meets the criteria, the bubbles will be filled in. So a very important note is combining three of a kind. For example, if you want to have a stronger unit, you buy three of them and the game will combine them into a stronger unit. Depending on the game that you're playing, it will automatically do it or it may not. If you're playing Dota Auto Chess, you have to manually put all three on the board. And if you're playing Dota Underlords, it will automatically combine them. I don't know what Teamfight Tactics is gonna do, we'll see. So that's it, you're ready to play Auto Chess. You don't need to know anything else so just go in there know what the auto chess is not chess know what the board is know what the bench is and try to match up the symbols to get some unit synergy going so that you can kill the other opponents on your match once you've got your synergy going you just try to get three of a kind and combine the units into a stronger unit from the store now you're going to lose matches don't feel discouraged if you lose matches you know using these basic tactics you're probably going to find yourself making a lot of mistakes but that's fine learning the basics is the very first important thing you need to do to get started with a match this is Borna from Borna.tv this is my auto chess tutorial the basics auto chess is not chess know what the board of bench is and learn unit synergy should be your goals take care have a good day